Veracruz is now home of the champions. Coleraine High School New Mainly Brown Academics now has a bragging rights for athletics, and today they celebrated. From the baseline, Palmer, Palmer. Sounded at, at the end of the championship game that like we actually did it. Cool Reef High School in Southwest Miami Dane has never won a state title in any major sport in their 11 year history until now. And they came together as a family, as a brotherhood, and said, Hey, we're not going to lose this game. We're not going to lose this game. Before Saturday, their only athletic state title was for bowling. Now, basketball will be painted on the wall, giving this academically known school credibility on the court as well. We had a lot of support, a lot of fan support, but to us, it wasn't a Cinderella story because we always thought that we were going to win. You know, we knew we had a good team. We knew, like, what we had, but nobody else knew. This was a school that was under the radar. They beat top teams in order to get to the finals, but the team did get there, and so were the fans. $30 a student got a bus ride to the game in Lakeland. They're also another key step for us to, to be a championship team. You know, with them behind our back to get the support when we're down, you know, they were right behind us to pick us back up. But they pulled out a win, and we'll never forget the moment. It has probably been after the game where... I was trying to run around, trying to find my dad, and when I found him, I hugged him. Yeah. I finally got one. 69-60. I'll never forget that. I don't remember scores, but I'll never forget that. The school has 3,500 students who pride themselves on academics. Newsweek Magazine, U.S. News, and World Report have ranked the school as one of the top in the nation. Athletics has always come secondary. They handle more pressure in a day-to-day -day basis in the classroom than they do playing the sport they love. That should be the outlet for them. But their coach knew they had what it took, proving there's no limit to what these hey, students can do. Uh, it was like the, one of the happiest moments of my life. I was so proud, you know, of the team. And it was just a great moment. In Southwest Miami-Dade, Jennifer Gray, South Florida Nightly News.